Dave Gardy here live for Golf Center TV. Here with me is Jenny Sue, who is a two-time NCAA All-American and teaching pro Kirk Lucas. They're going to talk about takeaway and backswing playing. All right, what we've done is we've robbed the tool shed here a little bit. It's something that anybody can do at home, and it'll help you with your takeaway. It'll help you with your backswing playing. It's a terrific way to spend time in the winter working on your golf swing. We've taken a ruler, nice metal ruler here. We've set the golf ball on the edge. We've, we've robbed, I, I'm not sure what this is. I think it's a, it's a piece of fiberglass and it's just a nice little rod here. Anything will work. Another golf club will work, a, an old shaft, anything that you can, you can align next to your golf club. And we're going to just use this as a pointer. And this is just going to give us a reference point. Now Jen's going to take her setup. And the flaw in the drill is that, that uh, normally her hands would be more at her belt buckle, but for the sake of practice, it, we, we can't get it done. So what we're going to do is have her take her setup. Now watch the club head track back. It'll swing right along the ruler, up and inside of it. Then the end of it, whoops, let's start over. Go, you gotta go much slower for me. Okay, what we've got here is the golf ball on a ruler. We've got a, a fiberglass rod, which we're gonna use as a pointer. And Jenny's gonna start her back swing. And what we're looking for here is the club head to swing along the ruler and start to swing up and inside of it as she takes the club back perfectly. Hold right there. And this is the position that you've seen in a million times before where the shaft's virtually parallel to your target line. You see it in all the magazines, you've seen it in all the instruction books. Now, from here is where it gets to be fun. As the club starts to break up, the rod here will point very slightly outside the golf ball, right there. So now Jen's in a position to hit a short pitch shot, a knockdown shot under the trees if she has a limited backswing. There's a lot of uses for this. Now as she continues to go, she's going to just draw a line with this just slightly outside the ruler and now she's got a club in just a perfect position going back. Her plane's ideal to where all she has to do is rotate her body through. The club will track that same plane right back. Keep turning, Jen. Keep turning right to impact. Here she comes. And now she's going to create a beautiful strike. So we're going to watch her rehearse that a couple more times. So the golf club's going to start right along the ruler in the takeaway. And then it's going to begin to work up and in. And now the, the pointer points just outside the golf ball there. And as she continues to go, notice where it points just outside the ruler. And that's just a beautiful backswing position there. Now go ahead and unwind the same way. You came back. And now she's right to impact. Club face is square. Her hips are open. Her shoulders are open. She's in a great position to strike the golf ball. And this is something you can do over and over and over. And you can vary the speed in which you, in which you learn to do it. So it will become a habit. It will become part of your golf swing. It's just terrific training for your backswing. And it also requires a little, a little mental focus. You've got to pay attention there, don't you, Jen? Mm -hmm. Good. Start again. Now a little bit faster this time. So again, the club head comes back and up and in inside the ruler. The rod points just slightly outside the golf ball. Now she continues back. Great. A couple more. Beautifully done. Now let's do one where we do it very quickly all the way to the top of your back. So we'll see if you've learned it and if you train it and if it's become part of your swing. Beautiful. Good. One more time. All the way to the top. Uh-huh. Good. Now a little bit slower. Excellent. There you go, Jen. Well done. All right, that's today's exercise in working on your takeaway and your backswing playing.